Good morning, Fall City Middle School. It is Tuesday, August 23rd. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right, everybody. Excuse me. All right, here we go. Today, for lunch, on this Tuesday, it is Taco Tuesday. So you'll be having tacos, refried beans, tri potatoes, corn, and milk. Happy, legitimate, real birthday to Skyland Ostoff. We hope you have a wonderful day today, Skyland. And everybody, if you see her in the hallways, tell her happy birthday today. All right, next up, hygiene. You're going to hear me say it multiple times because it's the beginning of the year and it's hot out. Middle school kids, you need to take a shower every night or every morning before you come to school. All right? Always. Even if you just sit around because you're at the age where you start to smell bad. All right? And I don't want anybody getting bullied because they smell bad. So the easiest way to take care of that is keep yourself clean. All right? Uh, parents, if you're watching, make sure you're washing their clothes. And then don't let it sit in the washer because that gives a rancid smell. So make sure you dry those clothes. Kids, if you do your own laundry, smell your clothes. If they smell bad, don't wear them, all right? Have your parents rewash them. So shower every night, make sure your clothes are clean, make sure your shoes are clean, and then finally, use deodorant. Because some of you do weights, AMPE, and recess, uh, you're pretty active during the day. So when you're done, if you don't shower after PE, make sure that you're using deodorant, all right? I'm just helping you out for the future, all right? Um, because I'm telling you, if you go into a job interview and you smell like a dead cat, nobody's probably going to hire you. All right? So, you guys got to take care of yourselves. Hopefully, your parents are working on this with you. But, um, especially sixth graders and my seventh grade. Seventh grade, you're extra stinky. All right? We got to make sure you guys are doing the hygiene thing. Now that you're down with me, I will remind you every day. Okay? So, seventh graders, take care of yourself. All right. A little awkward subject, but... If you work in a middle school, it's not awkward at all because every year we have this conversation. About this time of year. But I will say you guys usually do better once we talk about it. All right. Enough with the hygiene. Here we go. A couple announcements from Miss Boatwright. First of all, uh, NJHS students will meet today, Tuesday, during Block 2. Bring your trays to Miss Boatwright's room. That is, so today during lunch, these students need to meet in Miss Boatwright's room. Jacoby Bangert, Madison Eberly, Callan Furness, Bodie Jones, Miyuna Kong, and Taylor Moore. You students will need to get your trays just like last year and head up to Miss Boatwright's room for NJHS. Um, tomorrow, these NJH students, NJHS students, will meet um, tomorrow during Block Three in Miss Boatwright's room. Wyatt Koontz, Lathan Ritchie. Caleb Kaiser, Tatum Maddox, Bella Johansson, Bristol Titus, and Jade Romo. And then on Thursday, during Block 3, these students will meet in Miss Boatwright's room. Kenley Alexander, DJ Jazzy Strecker, Deacon Jacobs, Camden Jean, Reagan McNeely, and Madeline Hawley. So, for today though, it is Jacoby, Madison Everly, Callum Furness, Bodie Jones, Mina Kong, and Taylor Moore. Those are the ones that are meeting today. All right, got that done. Next up, our AOK -okay of the day is going from Miss Milam out to Addison Frenzel for helping me pick up a drop container of pencils. Thank you, Addison, and thanks for being a great member of the Fall City Middle School family. All right, now, your words of wisdom. There's an old English proverb, and it goes like this. Many things are lost for want of asking. In other words, we miss out on a great deal of life because we don't ask for what we need. This is important, middle schoolers. You need to ask for help. We've talked about this many times, especially when dealing with your friends. Do you need help with math? Then ask. Don't be afraid of looking stupid. In fact, you only look smarter for having asked. Do you want to sit closer to the blackboard or to the whiteboard? so you can hear or see better. Then ask. Let the teacher know if you have any special accommodations. Do you need help with a problem at home or at school? Then ask. Ask a parent, a counselor, a friend, teacher. Keep asking until you get the help you need. Today, remember this. 
Oops. <laughs> if you need help, don't lose out by not asking. I'll tell you what, guys, as a coach, I always tell the kids, you're never going to have to run for asking, but if you mess up, you're going to have to run extra. So it always pays off to ask. Have a wonderful day, everybody. Don't forget to ask for help. Hygiene, hygiene, deodorant, showers, all right? Clean clothes. Have a wonderful day, everybody, and I will see you all tomorrow.